today because uh, a squad was evicted uh, yesterday in the morning. We were sleeping inside the building. They got inside around five o'clock in the morning so violently. They were kicking people and they arrested some of us and calling, you are mafia, we are legal people, we are recognized by the state. Why they are doing so to us? Even they didn't let us to go to the toilet or drink some water. They took us after one hour to the bus and forced us to sit in. They kept us so hungry since the morning and they brought us to the detention center. Uh, they separate uh, many people and they were checking our documents. Uh, even we asked for water to wash our face and drink some water. They did uh, not let us to do anything. After two or three hours, they took us again to the bus. And they said, you are going to a good place, but they brought us to a closed camp. On nous cherche des, déjà une place, on nous fait déplacer, donc on quitte déjà bientôt là, on va partir. Ok, go in. C'est le nom de leur bis. C'est ça. Oui. Libéré 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 They were scared because the cops had the sticks. Were the cops beating them? Yes. They slept for two days in the buses and they never had food. Two days they did. The plan is to, for tonight, we will try to have the, the people safe, the people from Bobulinas. They wanted to, to ask for solidarity tonight, so they uh, decided to make a call, to, to call people to gather for this night, to have food, to have a mattress so they can sleep here, and uh, to protect them. Oh my God, you know what? That's solidarity in action. I mean, look, look, look how many stuff we have. We have the food, we have pot, we have everything, everything. Uh, and I think that's the most amazing thing when people come together and uh, we, we all get to, to, to help, you know? We all get to drink stuff, we all get to drink our love, you know? Help us. Yes, that's the best thing ever. <laughs>